Hi, I'm Travis Kircher, and I'm actually here with Elmo and astronaut Ricky Arnold here at the Kennedy Space Center. And this may be a first for WDRB News, an interview with a Muppet and a human being astronaut at the same time. So this is this is really interesting. Elmo, let me, uh, did you just get here at Kennedy Space Center? I mean, how far is it from Sesame Street? Oh, it's a long, long, long time away. It's very far. Very far. Yeah, Elmo flew. Did you fly Delta or what What, what airline? Elmo flew as a carry-on. Carry-on. <laughs> Oh, gosh. Elmo fits in a bag. <laughs> so, so, so why are you here today, Elmo? Oh, wait, Elmo's so excited. Elmo's here with Mr. Ricky, right? Hi, That's Mr. Right. Ricky. That's right. Hi, how are you? Good to have <laughs> you here. Oh, thank you. And we are here to watch the Orion. Is that a right? The That's Orion right. It's Orion, launch. yeah. Uh-huh. The oh. first test launch of the Orion. The Orion. Ricky, I, I, I heard a NASA employee say earlier today it feels like the old days here at NASA. Could you kind of explain maybe what that means? And, and does it, is it, is it... Does it kind of harken back to the old Apollo days? Well, it's I I don't remember a whole lot of the old Apollo Apollo days, but it is exciting. Even since uh, the shuttle stopped flying a few years back, it's it's good to see the excitement and the enthusiasm back. And folks, I was listening to the radio on the way in, and people are excited to see us start flying hardware from Florida again. Well, Elmo, I see you got a, a suit on there. Or, That's right. See, or, Elmo's got a patch on his hat. A patch. Says Orion. Orion. Patch. Yeah. <laughs> is today brought to you by the letter O? Oh, well, you got it. <laughs> So, so I, the suit and everything, are you are you going up? Oh, wait, Elmo would love to. Elmo doesn't think he's going up. Elmo wants to. Yeah. But you know who's, who's going up? Who's that? His, uh, you know Oscar the Grouch? Is his, he? His, yeah. No, well, not Oscar, but his pet worm slimy. Is he really? That's, That's right. right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Oscar the Grouch is pet worm slimy. Well, why don't you go? Well, Elmo's got other stuff to do. Other stuff to do. Okay. <laughs> Elmo wants to watch the launch. Watch Elmo the launch. Elmo wants to see it go up. So, uh, but but it could mean that the guys like Ricky here could could uh, could be going up someday. That's true. That would be great. Uh -huh. Elmo would like to one day. Maybe you could come with us. Yeah. That'd yeah. Be awesome. When Elmo's older, he would love to. When you're older, how old are you? Three and a half. Three and a half. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, Ricky, you know it it, it uh, they've talked about this could be the pathway to Mars. Do you, what's your opinion on I it? Mean, could you kind of maybe put this into context? This is our first step getting there, um, and that's going to be a long journey. Uh, but uh, this is a big first step for us on the path to Mars. And Elmo, um, there's a question I have to ask. It's totally off the wall, but, uh -huh. but why do you talk about yourself in the third person? Oh, it's a monster thing. It's a monster thing. <laughs> Okay, okay. Elmo can't explain it. Elmo was born that way. <laughs> so, um, well, I guess, are you going to be down, uh, where are you going to be watching this from? Elmo's going to be watching it. Elmo's got a VIP seat. VIP right, seat. Yeah. yeah, baby. Oh, great. <laughs> what, what kind of perks do you get with that? Uh, like space ice cream. Space ice cream? Uh-huh. Cool. And, and, the, and the badge. And the badge. Is that uh -huh. how you got that? That's right. That's, and the suit? Yeah, baby. <laughs> Well, uh, I'm going to wrap it up here. Um, before you go, uh, you guys could just say uh, say hello to our Facebook fans and our viewers in Louisville, Kentucky. Okay. At, uh, at WDRB. WDRB? Right. Okay. Hello, WDRB. WDRB. This is Elmo. And Ricky. <laughs>